Are you looking for a blood ketone meter? My wife just started the keto diet and I've been on a carnivore diet, which is basically like an extreme keto diet for since February. It's November right now, so almost an entire year. And we've never had a blood a ketone meter before to test if we're in ketosis. So we decided to get one today and I wanna do an unboxing of this thing because I found it from someone that I highly respect who knows a lot about ketones and being in ketosis and all that. First of all, hi. Hi to all the new dads out there. This is Dad Reviews. This is where I give you my unedited, hopefully more authentic look at the products that we like, use, and have. And I find to try and be healthy with. So if you're interested in that, you might want to consider clicking that subscribe button and hit the bell. That way you actually get notified of our videos. So there's a doctor that I know and follow and talk with on YouTube, um, Dr. Eckberg, and he is all about being in ketosis, having the most optimal body that you can. And I was looking through his store one day on Amazon and I saw this uh, ketone meter right here and I was like, all right, if he recommends it, then it has to be the one that I'm gonna try out. So I went ahead and picked it up and I wanna do a little uh, unboxing to see what this thing looks like. There's a few different ketone meters out there. I know that there's one called Keto Mojo. Although that one I uh, couldn't get on Amazon. I don't know if they stopped selling it or whatever. I think Walgreens has one that you can buy, just kind of like a generic brand one. But uh, this one, like I said, was highly recommended. Come, it's like a kit too, so you get like little starter strips because uh, since you're testing it, there's three different ways to test your ketones. There's your breath, there's your blood, and there's urine. Uh, the, I find that the blood's probably just the best way to test it. It's probably not the most convenient, but it's kind of like testing your glucose uh, if you are if you want to test how much sugar's in your body, or how much glucose is in your body. So we got that R, got that R in there, just one package of R. And this is the one that we got right here. It's made by a company called Keto Coach. I'd never heard of Keto Coach before until I saw this on his store. And uh, what I really like is how small this thing is. If you're a woman or even a man, I mean, you could fit this inside of a purse, a messenger bag, a briefcase. You might even be able to put that in your pocket with how small it is. It uh, has auto coding, which honestly, I'm not even too sure what that is, but I'm assuming it, it automatically knows something by the test strip that you put in there. And then it also has fast results and a small blood sample, 0.8. Um, uh, what I don't only it's not ohms. I don't know what that is. Y'all know what that is down in the comments below. Y'all let me know. Um, some kind of like Latin thing, something liters. Uh, let's see, auto coding, teacher code, accurate, awesome. Everything is awesome here. If you guys want to check this out too, I'm gonna link it up down in the description below. But let's get into this thing. I'm gonna need my knife again. The old Vance, uh, Mike Vance, right there. We're gonna slice that open. Let's see what comes in the box. Y'all ready? Open that up, open that up, open that up. Okay, we got a quick start guide. Okay, that's gonna be important because we're gonna need to know how to do it. And then there's also the frequently asked questions. If you guys need to read any of that, y'all can pause the video and check that out. Uh, let's see, this looks like the little puncture thing. I don't know what these things are called. Autolet, lancing device and lancelet. So this is the thing that you're gonna put on your finger and stick it to make a little blood come out. And then, um, I'm assuming the, oh, these are, okay, the, the lancelets are the things that actually poke into the skin. Now we have, whoa, there's a user guide here. Is this all English or does it go to a different language? This is all English. So they give you a lot of information here about how to use this thing and probably a lot of like how to, uh, how to know if you're in ketosis and all that type of thing, the things that it recommends, the numbers it recommends. Then it comes with this cool little carrying case here. Oh, there's a little sticker in here as well. It just says Keto Coach. So if you want to support them, you guys can do that. Um, comes with a little bag here, a little pouch, if you will, zipped up all the way around. Kind of looks like a, a makeup bag, sort of, except one that opens all the way. Um, cat number, manufacturing date, strip here if y'all there's a this model number and all that type of stuff if you guys care to check out any of that y'all can pause the video but we're gonna a little unzip right there open up it's got a little pocket here obviously to hold your meter you got your meter right here very simple to use it looks like very or very simple design i should say and this right here are your test strips one thing i was wondering is how many come in here 
I'm assuming this is one, only one thing in here. So one, two, three, four, five times two is 10 right there. So you get 10 strips. And then you have right here some important information about blood ketone test strips right there. Um, I'm assuming this is kind of just like maybe a quick, uh, quick, another quick guide type of thing as opposed to reading this whole thing. Um, let's see what else. You got the little pouch right here. This is where you put your meter. I don't know what this would be used for right here. That's interesting. And okay, that's all that's in the pouch there. Oh wait, we got a little, little noobly new right there. I got maybe you can probably put a pen right there or something so you can write down stuff. So let's see, Keto Coach, it runs on, whoa, two button batteries, the CR2032 lithium batteries. These are the Toshiba ones, or the ones that come with it. I can show you guys that real quick. That's what you're looking at, if that's going to focus. If you guys need these batteries too, I'll link them up down in the description below. Maybe you uh, need a replacement if you already have one. Looks like it has a two little feet on the back here so that it doesn't slip whenever you have it on the counter. I believe you put your test strip in right there so that it can get a good reading. Looks like there's also some kind of USB port right here. Although I'm noticing that it didn't come with any sort of USB cord. At least I don't see one in here, but I mean, a lot of people have those just lying around. Uh, I, I'm assuming that's to charge it. Although there might be some software or something that you can download so that you can keep track of all your stuff, which would be super cool. Uh, there's a little switch on the side here as well. Flip that up. Oh, that ejects the test strip, I bet, whenever you uh, are done with it and you got your reading. You just simply swipe up on it. I don't see any sort of on-off switch on here, so I'm assuming it's triggered by whenever you put your... Uh, your test strip in there with your uh, blood sample. It does have a nice little peel on here. We can peel that off. Y'all ready? Nice. I love those sa the sounds of like the paper coming off or the little plastic things coming off. Oh wait, look, <laughs> I'm an idiot. Here's your power button right there. Hit power, power. Hold it, oh, hold it down. You gotta hold it down to turn it on. Everything all lights up and whatnot. And then that is, yeah, you're setting your, I'm assuming that's setting your date. And is today the 9th? Today is the 9th, November 9th. And you, if you want a 12 hour, a 24 hour clock, we're going to go 12 hour. The time right now is 11, whoop, nope, I'm going to go the other way. 11.28, oops, 11. Anyway, I guess I should show you guys a little timestamp on the bottom. I'm assuming that's for the data collection so that it knows whenever you've taken your readings. And I'm assuming this means to insert your test strip right there, which I am not going to do right now because uh, I was reading that the best time to test your ketones is in the morning. After you fasted for a good while, you know, through the night you're fasting and before you eat breakfast, before you break your fast, the word breakfast, you uh, you want to do your ketones then, that way you're in a fasted state. And then uh, you might want to check it once or twice throughout the day, maybe after you've eaten to kind of see how those meals have affected you being in ketosis or not. Um, it kind of give you an idea of uh, if there's any foods that are kicking you out of ketosis. And so that's what we plan on doing is kind of, uh, since we're getting into this for the first time with the data here is noticing when we're going into ketosis in the morning if we're in ketosis which you want to be at what I read one millimole and then um, hopefully hopefully you're higher than that in the morning um, because throughout the day as you eat it may go down it may go up you kind of need to judge it and kind of see if you're kicking yourself out of ketosis or not but um, that is a look at this keto coach thing let's go ahead and see if yeah, you turn it off by holding it down right there. And uh, looks like a solid unit right here and fit easily into the palm of your hand. I can actually grasp it, my fingers all the way around it. So give you guys a good idea for size there. Taking a look at the Autolet, um, it's uh, about the size of my finger, honestly, right there. That's my index finger right there. So you can easily pocket that as well. 
and uh, they give you some uh, safety information on the back here. If you guys want to pause the video, y'all can read some of that to get an idea. If you guys need, if you guys want or need more of the test strips or the lancelets too, I'm gonna link all that up down in the description below, along with the meter right there. If you guys want to go and check that out, y'all go read other people's reviews. Don't just take my word for it. Uh, this thing, you know, I don't even know how many reviews it has on Amazon, but that's usually the thing that I usually kind of go by is um is uh how many uh reviews the thing has let's see i'm pulling it up right now this thing has 695 reviews with a four point four and a half star rating so that looks like a solid product like i said go check it out down in the description below if you guys want to see the the book that kind of got me into wanting to go keto this is it's written by this guy dave asprey and this is another book he wrote called superhuman but he has a, a a book about the bulletproof diet which is a very cyclical keto diet i'm gonna put my review of that right there on the screen you guys go click that video. I'll see y'all in that video. Thank you dads for watching. That thumbs up is appreciated and dad out.